going to be a digital file that gets sent that's too big for the repeater. It's going to stop and, and continue on. So we'll see what happens here. You'll, you'll see the blocks coming through. And uh, you can actually see the text coming through over here. And um, it's, it's exceptional. We're sending this big file through. Um, and this is using FL AMP. So FL AMP, an exceptional um, uh, kind of program to allow us to send files over the air. No internet at all. What you can see here is that we're halfway done. We see all of the blocks we're missing, but the blocks are starting to go away. You see them dropping down as, as more, more are actually coming in. <clears throat> and so the intent here is to shut down the repeater, have it what's called a kerchunk, and then uh, restart it and continue it on. So, so let's see what happens here now. Repeater is timed out, it appears. And it's restarting. And as you can see here, it is right here, 51%. Okay, so we started it back up again. And let's see what we have. Yep, there we are. Started it back up properly. And it's done. We have a file that's been saved. It's exceptional. Okay, broken into three pieces instead of two. But uh, hopefully everybody got all the blocks. KB3 EFS. W and two N A N repeater. KB3 EFS, KC2 to you, 100% receive. Great job. All right, we're going to start by sending an HTML file. And uh, let's see how it works. So you'll see it here. Here it comes across. You can see the missing blocks. You can see it's a NNY mod, etc. etc. HTML file. It's very, very interesting how this thing works. So what we're looking at is a screenshot of, of, uh, of FLAMP, an, an absolutely fantastic program that we use to send files. Um, and, and in, in an encapsulated format. And so what I just did, you can hear it on the radio, is um, I actually sent a tar and zip file across the airwaves and had it sent out to a couple of other guys and uh, it was successful.